quite done with summer yet, but yeah. as we go from July into August, we're actually looking at temperatures going down here. Today will likely be the hottest day of the week. So let's get you out there. 517, hope you had a good weekend. Glad you're with us. We're on your side with weather and traffic together every seven minutes. First off, here are the weather headlines. This, as I mentioned, will be the hottest day of this week. Uh, more 80s in the forecast than 90s going forward here, and rain chances are fairly low. Now, having said that, I am tracking a couple of showers this morning. We had that big front that came through yesterday with showers and thunderstorms really active Saturday night. And then yesterday we had some stronger thunderstorms primarily from Charlotte on eastward, and we're still getting a little bit of moisture lingering here north of town. So getting a little bit of rain this morning here south of 421. This is right on Highway 64 between Taylorsville and Lenore getting a shower over this way. A couple here north of Turnersburg, north of Statesville. So again, the still the atmosphere is trying to dry out. It'll take some time, but it is in the process of doing that. And in fact, if anything, our temperatures and our humidity levels will be down over the next couple of days. 69 right now in Huntersville. Good morning, Matthews. You're at 70. It's 68 Indian Trail, Weddington, Upper 60s, Tika K, Ballantyne, back towards Lowell and Cramerton. We're 69 now in Hickory, 68 Concord, Kannapolis, 69 in Monroe, and 68 for Gastonia and down into Rock Hill. For today, mostly sunny skies. The rain chances are actually pretty low, no more than about a 20% chance. Afternoon temperature right around 90. The best opportunity for this afternoon, aside from that stray shower this morning, would be up over the mountains and also south and east of Charlotte. But again, it's no more than about a 20% chance in any one spot. If anything, the humidity level will be coming down as we go through the next couple of days. Now, eventually, perhaps a bit more widespread rain gets in here, especially Thursday. Looks like it could be an active day, but our humidity level, as I say, coming down today, tomorrow and Wednesday, it starts to bounce up and it comes back with a vengeance as we head towards Friday and Saturday. And again, that will prompt more thunderstorms. So sunshine for most of us for today and tomorrow, courtesy of high pressure. This front back to the west eventually gets here. That will be a trigger for additional showers and thunderstorms as we head towards the back end of this uh, coming week. So 90 for today, 68 for tonight, then 87 tomorrow and Wednesday. Rain chances pretty low, though late Wednesday into Thursday could get active. And again, spotty thunderstorms, but look at those temperatures. They're not bad. Friday and Saturday in the 80s.